is going on guys and welcome back to another YouTube video. I am officially moved in to my new crib. I'm going to be giving you guys a little bit of a tour around the place and showing you kind of what it looks like because we've moved a lot of stuff in. I had originally already filmed this video when the house was like almost empty except for my room but now we have a lot more things that make it seem a lot more homey and actually filled. So I'm going to take you guys through a quick walkthrough of the house and show you guys what we're working with because honestly this is my dream home well it looks a little bit rough from the outside but it's a lot better inside all right so most people come in through the back door so come on in I'm gonna show you we've got a little bit of a mudroom area going on right here and this is all under renovation by my roommate who is currently holding the camera for me but as you can see back here we've actually got the game room and i'll go a little bit deeper in on that as we get into it but as you walk in the front door the back door there's actually an entrance to my bathroom and then that leads back there into my room as you can see so i've got my bathroom in here we've got the entrance kind of like a mudroom got some storage and then we have the beautiful kitchen absolutely beautiful all new appliances newly renovated wolf picture on the wall coffee pots air fryer perfect place for meal prepping and building a ton of muscle nutritionally we got the pantry we come in here, we've got the dining table, we've got cabinets on the wall, a bottle of Tito's, extremely, extremely important. So we have wolf picture on the wall, and we got these two new couches. So when I had officially filmed this video, this entire space was empty. And we've got the Xbox plugged into this beautiful 70 inch TV we got from Costco on sale. Have this Sony sound bar. And if you come over to this side of the living area, we got all of our musical instruments laid out. And as you can see, we don't have any curtains on any of the big windows yet, because these windows are massive, and we need to cover them up with curtains. As we go back into the hallway, we've got another bathroom right here. So there's two bathrooms, and then we've got a bedroom off to the right, extremely clean as you can see. And then we've got Caleb's room. So this is gonna be my other roommate's room when he uh, ends up moving in. We've got some guns in the corner because we are living in rural Montana. Um, and then we come into my room right here. This is my prized possession. We've got the desktop on top of the nightstand connecting. Uh, down here, we've got the microphone for all of, uh, all of the videos that I like to film. The laptop right here, we've got the bodybuilding trophies, Rise supplements, code BDON for 15% off. Uh, we've got the Lego Star Wars. We've got the mirror right here for taking aesthetic bodybuilding photos, queen size bed with the window. And then over here, we've got plenty of Lego Star Wars. Um, we've got a basketball, and then we've got an entire closet full of Young LA. Also, code beat on for 15% off of that. And the coolest part about my room is that it leads directly into the game room through these sliding glass doors. So out here, we did not have this when I filmed the original video either. This is a brand new addition to the household. And this is a seven foot pool table that we hauled in yesterday. Um, and this, honestly, I have always wanted a pool table. I've always wanted a pool table in my house before, but I've never actually had the space. And so to be able to actually have one and play all the time is an absolute blast. And it's great to have people over and bring people in. We ultimately have the idea of putting like a bar light in here, doing renovations on a lot of this stuff and making it look like an old timey, like Western bar. And then we've got right here, which Carter just set up, we've got a beautiful dartboard. So we've got games for days. And with the pool table, it also turns into a ping pong table. So that's awesome. So if we ever wanna play ping pong, we can also do that as well. So I'm excited, because I've always wanted a ping pong table and a pool table, and we were able to get it all in one, which is fantastic. And so hopefully 
will have this place looking super nice and snazzy. And this is honestly everything that I would want in a house. I am, I'm perfectly content with it. The size is awesome. Um, and so yeah, this is, that's why this is my dream home. And uh, it's Castle Beedon if you look at the internet Wi-Fi. So the plan for today is to go hit some chest. Now I've taken a rest day two days the past week just because I've been feeling a little bit under the weather, but I feel like I've finally kicked it. I had a nagging cough and like some sniffles that were getting really, really annoying. So I'm gonna take you guys through this chest workout. Hopefully it goes well. The past, I've had a couple workouts this week that didn't feel so great because I was sick and I felt really low energy. Um, but as of right now, we're gonna go try to get it in. Um, I've been using a lot more machines in my chest work and that's one thing you guys might notice, but as time goes on, uh, especially as I get deeper into prep, I will probably start using even more machines um, just to decrease the overall, overall fatigue of the exercises that I'm doing and the workouts that I'm doing. Little bit of an outfit check for you guys here. I'm wearing the Performance 440 Young LA t-shirt, code beat on for 15% off. And these shorts, I always get asked where I got them from. These are are actually raw gear so if you guys want to go check out raw gear that's totally fine I'm not gonna lie they don't sponsor me anymore but I still really like some of their stuff all right so lately for pre-workout I've actually been doing two things so what I'll do is I'll take one scoop of the cherry pump daddy it's non-stem so no caffeine in there because obviously you know I'm working out a little bit later in the day and I'd like to go to bed early and I'm taking two of the Pump Cap Max. So I take two of the Pump Cap Max right now, and then I drink the pre, uh, the Pump Daddy pre-workout on the way to the gym. And that's just, that's been working really well for me lately. I, uh, I absolutely lump, love the pump ingredients, um, but I, I feel like the Pump Caps, there's just something about them that works really, really well, so I like to kind of mix it up and get one scoop of this, so not two scoops, just one scoop of the Pump Daddy and two of the Pump Cap Max, so that's half a serving of the Pump Capsules. So if you guys want to check either of those out, go to Rise Sups and use code BEDON for 15% off. Whenever I'm bulking, it's definitely not fun to drink a pre-workout, especially when it's a pump formula that doesn't taste quite as good, but when I start getting a little bit more, you know, hungry throughout the day, and I'm on a little bit lower calories, the uh, the pump pre-workout starts to taste a lot better. So I like to add it in, but I still like to get the crazy benefits of those pump caps. All right, so we're gonna start off with bench press. My main goal on the cut is to try to keep my weight that I'm pressing the same. I'm trying to maintain as much of my strength as possible. This is the big compound movement, meat and potatoes of the workout. Everything else is gonna be a little bit less fatigued. 